It's coming. We're real excited about my tickets, man. Ticket sales officially kicked off today for the 9-0 Fernando Guerrero's fight against the 7-0 Tyrone Watson out of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Guerrero has nine knockouts, Watson three. A top quality build that the entire country can see on Showtime television or for about 6,000 people, they'll see it close up. I was rushing here because I figured they would be sold out and I want to get as close as I possibly can. I want to see it all. <laughs> Ticket holders have a reason to be excited too. This is the first ever major fight in Salisbury, but Guerrero's trainer Hal Chernoff says it might not be the last. There's two things that have to happen uh, at this particular fight and that is that Fernando has to perform like he's capable of and like he's done in the past. And the other thing that has to happen is the seats have to be filled. If that happens, Showtime has pretty much assured us they will be back and they'll be back soon. And that could be a lucrative sell for local tourism, more money spent Not at restaurants on fight nights, more hype left. surrounding the hometown hero Guerrero. Chernoff hopes this 21-year-old fighter story is just beginning. It's happening and, and I hope they understand it. A lot of times when you're in a, a small area like this, they say, well, it can't be that big because it's from here. Yeah. And that's just not the case. This boy is the real deal. And Thus far, promoters say ticket pre-sales were more than expected and hope to sell out the entire Civic Center. Reporting in Wicomico County, Kevin Leahy, WVOC News, Salisbury.